Is Carl even in there? I don't even know if he's even in there. Oh, well, this is walk-in. We own the place. Whoa, finally, it's privacy, man. Just barge right in. Hello! Hey, welcome back to another episode of the Hotel Challenge, where we play as our friend Basil. We has to run this hotel and hopefully help all the guests. So, let's do it. All right. What's going on? What are we doing? What's Basil doing? Are we spying on the brats again? You know, I feel like we've had enough brats. Leave the brats alone, Basil. Leave them alone. We've had enough brats on this channel. We should just evict the brats. They've got their own thing going on now. When I first did this, I said, maybe we should do our own brats thing. And now we have our own brats thing going on. Should we kick out the brats? Let me see the agreement here. Hmm. They're paying 47 simoleons a day. They gotta be here seven days. How long has it been? Has it been seven days? How many days have they been here? Oh, no, it's been at least five days. Okay, so in two days, we get to kick them out. Okay, okay, well, we can wait that long then. Or do I kick them out now? Unjust evict. Yeah, go on, go on. They got their own thing going on. They can figure out where they want to live over the weekend. Oh, wait, it's five days left. Oh, well, yeah, we should definitely get rid of him then. Bye, brats. Get out of here. Is he going to make a phone call for this or it just happens? It just happened. Okay. We get to see them leave, sadly. No? It just kind of happened. Okay. There's no, like, sound effect or... No? Okay. <laughs> well, s s see you later. You know what? They're going to go off and create a whole brat empire in Delso Valley. So check out that Let's Play right now, right here. All right. Well, we have an empty vacancy, so let's see if we can fill it. Let's see here. Who we got? Who wants to stay here? I don't recognize any of these names. So this person comes with a toddler, though. So that's kind of fun. Should we grab them? Wait a minute. So this is how much they're willing to pay. And I'm only charging 47 simoleons. Oh, we could charge way more for these rooms. And we should. At least 80 simoleons. This is Kyle right here. Do I want Kyle? I kind of want Lee because they have a baby. That could be fun, you know? Ah, uh, you know what? Let's take Kyle. We don't have a baby bed in there. We don't have three beds. Let me go back. Kyle wants to pay 81 simoleons. Let's go back here. Let's change that to 81. The exact amount he will pay. And let's also move this down to three days. I want there to be some kind of turnaround, you know? He's got three days to stay here. And then maybe we'll um flip it and then get more money later on, you know? All right, Kyle, you're coming in. Any sound effect? Nothing? A anything? Do we get to see them walk in? No? Anticlimactic. Just gonna say that. It's just like, okay, cool. Well, let's meet him. Knock on the door or something. Is anyone home? Oh, come on. Open the door, Kyle. Is Kyle even in there? I don't even know if he's even in there. Oh, this is walking. We own the place. Kyle, the brats, did they clean up after themselves? Wait a minute. Brats, you left your clothes on the ground. The heck? Oh, Basil can't even go inside. We haven't been invited inside. Oh, no, his car's right here. Hey, man. Hey, hey man. Uh, can we come in? Can we come in? Oh, what the heck? Knock on the door. Knock on the door. He's there now. Knock on the door. Now go in there. Um... Whoa, finally, it's privacy, man. This is gonna be so good. Just barge right in. Hello! Oh, hi, how you doing? Just wanna make sure you're doing well. Is a new um, person staying in my hotel? Hello? H hello? <laughs> Kyle got out of there quick. Yeah, now use the bathroom. Perfect. Kyle just left. He just got the heck out of there. Uh, obviously, pl Frank is toiling. <laughs> Eat that, Kyle. Next time you use that bathroom, you're gonna get a little wet and a little bit annoyed. And Welcome to my hotel. Where did he go? Wait, what time is it right now? Oh, it's like 8.30. He left. He left the hotel. He just like ran into the city in Paris. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. Should I make some dinner? How are we feeling right now? We're just tired. Okay, let's just go to bed. Let's just go back home to our apartment. All right, go to sleep. All right, so it looks like for our aspiration, we have to handle emergency events and perform an inspection. Okay, all right, sounds good. Three of those, it looks like. Uh... Oh, hey, Vlad. Any vacancies? <laughs> nope, I filled up. Oh, what's happening? What's happening? I've come to suck your blood, Basil. <laughs> what? Because I don't have any openings right now? You don't want to stay here anyway. You live in a big house. Don't you come in my bedroom right now. Don't you come in my bedroom. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe this. There's mold on the ground. Is that a problem? We should probably take care of that. We should probably take care of that. You will get me a good rate on a hotel. Listen, man, we don't have any openings. Kyle took the last one after I kicked the brass out. He's going to be fine. Don't worry about it. This happens all the time. Yeah, this happens all the time. Well, down goes Basil. Get out of here, Vlad. Yeesh. Well. I'm out of here. Yeah, 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 yeah. There he goes. All right, where's my Uber? All right, he's gone. He's gone. Don't worry. The threat has left. We're good. Get up, Basil. Get, 
get up. Get, get up. Basil. All right, we're, we're awake now. What time is it? It's two o'clock in the morning. Go back to sleep. We got lots to do tomorrow. The whole vampire attack was really inconvenient. Should I be concerned about this whole mold situation? We'll, we'll keep an eye on it. Okay? If we start spreading throughout the whole hotel, then maybe I'll do something about it. For now, I will keep an eye on it. What's happening? Oh no, Basil's having a midlife crisis. Oh gosh, uh, that's that's fine. Um, I don't know if I can do this anymore. This is the fifth hotel I've run. Technically the fourth, because one of them, one of them was a boat. So uh, make yourself something to eat on the grill here. And then we'll start inspecting some of these rooms. All right, baked potatoes are done. If anyone wants them, but I know no one will take them. Even though there's no food or no way of eating in their own rooms, they all just have food somehow. They all just get food. Wait, hang on a second. Wait, you there. You want some baked potatoes? No, no, don't quit. I got baked potatoes right here. Oh my God, those baked potatoes stank. I'll make my own, thank you very much. Hey, uh, do they really stink? Oh, I'm eating those. Wait, what is she making? That looks really good. Wait, she just made it and then left. You're not gonna eat it? You're not gonna eat that one? Okay. Oh, you have to come down here to look at the rats. Yeah, fair enough. Sorry. I should probably take care of those. Let's put a little trap there. All right, anyway, let's see here. I guess I gotta wait for an emergency event to happen. Perform an inspection. Okay, let's uh, knock on this door. Break in. No, don't break in. Just go in there. Oh, look, it's Dr. Glue on. Hey, Dr. Glue on. Sweet. Dr. Glue on is watching the TV. Awesome. I think he lives in this apartment. What happened? What happened? Was that a good thing? What happened here? The lease on room number six has been reset and temporary grade period is in effect until 9 a.m. What's going on here? Who lives in six? I don't even know who's on what now. Oh, hang on. Here we go. Six right here. Grade period active. Is that good? Do I want this? Oh, grace period active, actually. What, what does that mean? Who lives here? You live here. Should I evict them just in case? It says justly evict. Oh, are they breaking the rules? Oh, the lease is up. Because we only had him set to stay here two days. And so the lease is up. So I can just evict her right now. Well, you know what? Bye. Is that it? Was that it? There's no like sound effect or anything. Not like a doom 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 sound effect. Okay. Or at least this sound effect. I mean something. It is something. Well, I have another opening now, so let's see who could stay here. Okay, okay. A bunch of people, I don't recognize their last names, but they're willing to pay a lot. Like 163? This elderly person wants to stay here for that much? I mean, cha-ching. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, this person's a teenager and a dog. Yeah, let's have the teen and the... Wait, how do they have this much money? 178 simoleons? We have to have the teen and the dog stay here. Let's up it to 178, the exact amount they have <laughs> and have the teen and their dog stay here oh you know what we should do as well you know what we should do because we know they have a dog let's say no pets <laughs> so we can find them every time oh sorry the rules say no pets and you have a dog so that's gonna be another thousand Somalians uh, for me. <laughs> yeah, definitely. No dogs allowed, uh, even though I know you're coming in with a dog. All right, perfect. You all set? Welcome on in. Any sound effect for this? Nothing? No sound effect. No like ding, 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 ding. All right, well, uh, what about? <laughs> Why does Basil go into their bathroom every time? First thing he does, inspect their bathroom. <laughs> Basil, what are you doing? Screaming at them. What are you doing? Basil's really falling apart. I don't know. Uh, all right, we got to spec stuff, right? This is the um, the room where James Turner and Dr. Gluon stay. I think James Turner sleeps on the little bed here, and then Dr. Gluon stays on the big bed. I think that's how it is. All right, so can I inspect stuff? I can sleep in their bed, right? Let's hide under the covers. That could be funny. Dr. Gluon, you can't find me. <laughs> Dr. Gluon's taking a shower. Or bath, I mean. Yeah, go inside. Go inside. Greet him in the bath. Hello. Oh, jeez. You're naked. Oh, my gosh. I expect this kind of service at Holiday Inn, but not here. Unlike Kyle, though, Dr. Gluon didn't run away. He stayed right here. He's like, okay, that's weird, but I'm not running away. It's kind of great we're meeting Dr. Gluon, but I was kind of hoping to meet James Turner. Is he going to be back anytime soon? I know he stays here. I mean, I've kind of seen Dr. Gluon before, but we haven't seen James Turner in a while. So, James? James? You think, you think he's coming back soon or... 
Um, I'm a big fan of his videos. Uh oh. Oh, glue on left. Okay. Well, that's fine. Oh, wait. He didn't leave. He was hiding under the covers. Time to glue on. That was our trick. All right. Well, let's meet our new tenants. The teenager with the dog. Let's see. What room is that? That's number six, right? Uh, I should probably number these rooms. Um, which one is six? Oh, uh, wait. I can visit right from here. Here we go. Travel. I want to put little numbers next to all the doors. That way I know. Do we have something like that in the game? Mm. All right. I visited the lot. Which, uh, which one is it? <laughs> I'm still the same place. It's probably the one that's lit up. Ah, it's this one right here. Perfect. Okay. Okay. Go, uh, deliver fine. Right off the bat. No pets. Should I meet them first? You know what? Let's eavesdrop. Let's eavesdrop. It's like, ooh, is that a dog? Ooh. He's like, is that a dog in there I can hear? Oh, I heard a puppy. Knock on the door. Hello. <laughs> Inspection time. Oh, the, the puppy was behind me. Oh. Oh, look at the puppy. Don't kill. Well, let's be friends with the puppy. I mean, I'm going to find them for having a dog, but that doesn't mean I can't be nice to the dog. Oh, God, the dog mean. Okay, okay. Can I pet you again? There we go. You're a good puppy. Where's your owner? I need to talk to them. Because the thing is, you're not allowed in here. Yes, no dogs allowed. Yeah, sorry. Uh, where's the owner at? They just have the dog here? All right, listen. We can't have a dog just being here. There's a strict no dogs allowed wall. First of all... Yeah, Obviously use the toilet. Yeah. Then prank the toilet. There we go. You know what? It's in the middle of the day, so it might be that the owner of this dog and the person staying at this hotel is at school right now uh, because they're a teenager. So that's a little awkward, eh? Oh. Well, sorry, buddy, but you're not allowed here because no dog's allowed, apparently, even though I knew you were coming. All right, deliver fine. No pets allowed, a thousand dollars. Hey, we had to slip that under the door. Yeah, just slip that under the door. Let's see it when they get home from school. It's a bit awkward. We should probably get out of here. Let, let, let's get out of here. Oh, wait. Don't I have to do this like inspection? Oh, hang on. Let me go back in there because I got to inspect stuff. You, you okay, Basil? This fountain is very slippery. This fountain here with the marble makes it a very slippery floor. All right, yeah, go inspect that. Looks like this toilet's been pranked recently. Another fine. <sighs> People need to take care of their stuff better, you know? I gotta do this three times. So that's one. Ooh, take a mud bath? Should I do that? No, let's not do that. We have our own shower. Inspect the shower, though. It would be really weird if the person comes back from school to their own room and sees Basil taking a mud bath. That would be weird. Uh, what's a dog barking at me for? Is it because of the fine? Don't worry about him. All right, that was done. Let's get out of here. Let's leave. The dog is kind of yelling at me. I gotta do one more inspection, but I'll do it to another person's apartment. Let's go over here. Um, next door. <laughs> Can I take the dog with me? No, let's leave the dog there. I feel by the end of this challenge, me and the dog are going to be the best of friends. Mostly because that dog's going to make us a bunch of money. Because every day we're going to find them for owning the dog. All right, let's see this room. This room comes with a couple of blow-up beds. Oh, and a, a cot as well. So that's cool. Can I inspect the TV in here? I can watch TV in here, but let me inspect that toilet. Because I got to do one more. All right, yes. sweet. We did it. And I got to use the bathroom, so we might as well use this one i don't think basil really needs his own place i think basil should just stay in other people's rooms oh hang on who's calling me oh chloe's calling me uh hey what the heck why would you kick us out uh, that is so not cool basil uh -oh. Ah, uh, I, I, I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry, but uh, we, we had to, we had to kick you out. You did not eat it up, and you left all the crumbs. I, I don't know what that means. What, 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 are, you, what are you talking about? Let's hang up, hang up, just hang up, hang up with the brats. Still waiting for an emergency event to happen. Am I a little sleepy? You know what? Take a little nap. Take a little nap in their bed. Yeah, <laughs> you got your pajamas with you. Perfect. Ah, it's nice. Uh oh, what's happening? Oh, oh, it's uh, donate to charity thing happening. Oh, Chloe, Chloe's calling me again. We're informing Basil of a settlement against his establishment. Oh my gosh, uh, an unlawful eviction practices. Expect a fine. The brats are fighting me. Chloe, what the heck? Chloe. Oh my gosh, uh, 175 simoleons. This is an outrage. This is an outrage. Can I fight this thing? Let's wake up. Wake up, Basil. Wake up. The person who's staying in this room has not come back yet. Probably, probably a good thing. Don't need to charity, though. This is cool. What do we got to do here? Select an object from your inventory. Oh, okay, okay. Do I have anything to donate? I got these headphones. You know what? Yeah. Give that away. Give those away. Those are some good headphones. Oh, it's James Turner. Hey, guys. Uh, I'm going downstairs now. Oh, okay, bye, James. 
That guy is so cool. That guy is the coolest. Uh, such a big fan. All right, mail those headphones. Yay, we did it. Uh, oh, James Turner is making videos on my computer. Oh, wow. He's recording videos. Need. What a cool guy. What a cool guy. We're still waiting for this emergency event to happen. Can I cause an emergency event myself? Can I, can I do this? Hang on a second. Wait, Dr. Gluon's giving James a present. Uh, oh, man, thank you so much. All right, no worries, James. Well, see you. Wow. Those two are best buds. I was going to come in here, though, because I'm going to order something off the computer, some fireworks. And yeah, I was going to get one of those. Maybe a few of those. Wait, I don't have enough funds to buy this? What the heck? I have zero dollars? What the heck? Brats, you stole my money! How dare you, Brats? They took all my money! Can I find these people again for owning a dog? I need money! So I can buy fireworks. So I can cause an emergency event. So I can solve it and level up my landlordliness here in this hotel. I don't know what's happening anymore. Bunch of people are hanging up here, though. I am hungry, so I'm gonna grab some of these hot dogs. Well, I heard the Brats. They're gonna, like, start a whole Brat Empire. You know? Out of revenge for this place they got kicked out of. Well, I like the Brats. They're a pretty fun group. Yeah. I wish I was a brat. You'll always be my brat. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, enough with the brat talk already. Ugh, done with the brats. It's nine o'clock. I'm not very tired because I slept in that one person's bed. These people are having like a romantic situation going. I feel kind of awkward standing in the middle of them. Oh my God, there's mold in the kitchen as well. I'm going to keep an eye on that mold. Make sure it doesn't get like too bad. Well, I'm kind of dirty. So let's go ahead and go home to our apartment. And then I'm going to take a shower. And then we'll go to bed. Should I take the dog with me? No, we'll leave the dog where they're at for now. Take a quick shower. You know what we should do, actually? The, the night is still kind of young. Let's tend the bar before we go to bed. Maybe people will come up and buy stuff from us. Wait, what does they donate to charity zero of one? But I did that already. Game, I gave those headphones away. I got nothing else to give. All right, Basil, won the ball. You there, would you like to buy a drink? Bar's open. It's 10 o'clock at night. We got something back here, I think. Hey, come get a drink. I don't know why I do this. I'm always like disappointed when they don't get a drink. Why is this even a thing? Maybe eventually they will come get a drink. All right, practice making drinks. Can I donate a drink to charity? Let's make one. Can't afford this. I have no money. Wait, 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 wait. Water's free. Okay. Yeah, make that water. All right, then put it in your inventory. Right. And now donate to charity. A glass of water. Hopefully it doesn't get too wet. All right, well, let me do it. It's selecting it, but it's not doing it. Basil, donate that to charity. Oh, no, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, water. There we go. Do that. All right, charity. Here's your water. Perfect. It's kind of classic Basil to donate water to charity. But anyway, we gave them headphones. Those were good headphones. I think when we moved to a different apartment, it like didn't count again or something. Anyway, let's tend the bar. Maybe someone will want to buy a drink from us. We need money. Hey, you want to buy a drink? We got water. You like water? It's uh. Comes highly recommended. We get it from the pole. Just right from the pole. Wait, hang on. Yay, swimming over. Here we go. Uh, wow. Just walked right on by. <laughs> Doesn't even want yummy pool water. Anybody else want some, some drinks or something? Anybody else? My vision for this bar would have I would tended and everyone would come out of their rooms and then just like mill about, drinking, having a good time. That was my vision. In reality, Sims like, nah. Okay, let's go to bed. It's two o'clock in the morning. Time to calculate how much we made on this day in the hotel challenge. No, we don't do that anymore. Not in this one, because they pay us normally. And I guess they don't pay us at all because we have no money. Did the brats take all our money then? Is that what happened? They just like drained our bank accounts? Well, hopefully tomorrow we get paid from the other tenants. Hang on, the charity gift drive, all the goodwill and positivity from the charity drive has lifted up your unit's rating. Let's go. Except for that one person that gave water, that person's a jerk. Um. Excuse me? What are they talking about? Okay, use the bathroom. Should I use my bathroom? Or use somebody else's bathroom? Let's just wander into this person's bathroom. I say we just use random people's bathrooms. I mean, I'm the manager of this hotel. If I were to use their bathrooms, I should be allowed to. All right, in we go. Anyone in here? No one's here. Okay, we'll use their bathroom. I love the toilet paper coming out of the air conditioning unit. It's fine. <laughs> Who built this place? Uh, let's use their shower. Doodle, doodle, doodle. Ah, that's nice. A nice shower. I'm not even dirty. I don't even need this. Okay, that's good. Let's go downstairs. See who's hanging out down here. 
Oh, this kid has a baby. It's so cute. Uh, hi, yeah. Um, I'm the uh, DoorDash guy here to deliver a baby. Anyone order this baby? Oh, no, I didn't order that baby. No, no. All right. Well, I'll just put it right here then. So, um, yeah, just uh, make sure you tip me via the app. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. I'm just kidding. That is his baby. That's his baby. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Uh, what's that baby doing? What's that baby doing? The, the, ba the baby's, the baby's, the baby's breaking stuff. The baby's breaking stuff behind you. Yeah, babies do that all the time. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, hang on. Who's calling me now? We'd love to have you join the powerhouse. What do you think? Oh, powerhouse. You know what? When I think of Basil, I think of powerhouse. Yes, I'd love to. 100%. Uh, oh, Mark is calling me. Yo, yo, Basil, what's going on? I got you in the powerhouse. Oh, they want me to go to the club meeting right now. Oh, I can't, I can't go, Basil. I can't. I mean, Marcus. What's your name? I can't go. I'm busy right now. I like how Marcus, like, just wants Basil involved. Even though Basil's not really a powerhouse guy. I mean, look at him. What do you mean? I work out. No, you don't. You're really scrawny. Uh, oh, free hamburger? Where'd you get that from? Hey, uh, could you uh, tell your baby to stop doing that? But, but they just, they just left. They just, they just left the baby. They just, the b there's a baby over here. The baby's in my office. The heck? I can't pick up the baby. They just left the baby in my office and then walked away. This is not a daycare. Though, actually, could I make more money if this was a daycare, though? Like, could I charge for this baby being here? Oh, I don't know. Also, can I make a law or rule that says no babies allowed? Can I do that? Oh, hang on. Who are you? Are you the mom? Oh, there you are. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, please don't have your baby hanging in my office. My office is not a daycare. Unless you want to pay me for that. In which case it is. Um, a hundred bucks, please. I'm very poor. I have no money. Oh, they introduced me to the baby. <laughs> now Basil's holding the baby. Which, which, um, <laughs> well, see you, Basil. I'll be back in about uh, five hours, okay? I, I'm, I'm not really shooting to look after a baby. Uh, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put you down here, okay? Be, be cool, baby, okay? Mm. It's fine. It's fine. Mm. Speaking of fine, can I find these people again? No, I can't. Can't find these people again. I mean, they still have a dog, right? Dog's still in there. Yeah, the baby made a mess of this place. Clean it up, Basil. I need social. I need fun. And we also gotta wait for this emergency event. I also need money. I wanna go back to Basil's office. It was so much fun. <laughs> no, that's my office. You can't go back there. Oh, boy. We're keeping an eye on the mold. Keep an eye on the mold, okay? Seems fine right now. Seems fine. No one panic. It's fine. All right, Basil, talk to these people because you need social. This guy seems nice. Owen. He seems like a nice guy. He's definitely a bad dad because he left his baby right on the floor there. But let's be friends with him. Hey, how you doing? You enjoying a stay here at the hotel? You know, babies are welcome. Uh, though they cost more money to be here. Thousand dollars extra a night. That's just a kind of roll. Oh, I'm not paying that. Anyway, so uh, what is uh, there to do about, you know, fun around here? Yeah, we need fun. Let's watch this TV. Don't worry, buddy. The baby's asleep. So if you're concerned about the well-being of the baby, the baby is falling asleep. These are great parents. They've come to this hotel for a vacation just leave that baby around let's put a movie on that could be fun a movie night at the hotel that's fun i'm glad i'm paying top dollar to stay here all right this is good my social's going up my fun's going up we got a movie going on some kind of like a college movie about colleges the baby's sleeping on the floor so this is just a great time a great time uh-huh yeah these rats oh my gosh there's so many of them like play some more traps here my fun and my social's going up so this is good turns out talking to people good all right everyone's moved on now um the baby is still sleeping on the floor i'm sure that's fine where are they staying anyway is it this room oh it's the room i went into to take a shower that's why i was seeing them they don't even have a crib they've got this baby staying in his room this is why the baby's on the floor sleeping some rooms have cribs some rooms don't. This one doesn't, and this is the one the baby's staying in. It's a fine hotel. It's, I can't even edit it. I can't even add. I can't add a crib in here because the edit button is grayed out. Okay, that's fine. Speaking of fine, can we find these people again? No, I can only find them one time. Where's all my money? I have no money. I got no money. I can't buy fireworks. I can't create my own emergency events. Someone have an emergency event already so I can level this up. What's going on over here? What's this all about? Do maintenance on this thing. Does so this explode every once in a while i can upgrade it well that thing's working well i guess let's go back to my own apartment should we take the baby with us no 
No, we'll leave the baby there. Oh, hang on a second. Under what conditions? Yeah! Free money! Free money. Hang on a second. Pause everything. We got some money now. Now, order some fireworks. Uh, Dr. Gluon's calling me. Yes? Under what conditions? Oh, no, we did that already. You want to you spend some time with them? Yeah, go for it, Dr. Gluon. Go for it. Let's see. Let's go into this apartment. All right, I don't see anyone in here because I'm never in the room when I go inside. <laughs> they seem to never be in here, but that's fine. I got the fireworks now. I'm only doing this to collect the insurance money, okay? We'll put that there and then just light it up. Light it, get out of there. Oh my gosh, there's an emergency in this room. Oh my gosh, there's an emergency. Oh my god! Oh my gosh! There's a fire! There's a fire! There's a fire! I know. You should probably call the landlord. You should probably call the landlord and report there being an emergency. <laughs> it was outside already. He left. I have to help! Someone call an emergency quick so I can level up. Oh uh, yeah, Basil, you uh, your place is on fire, man. Oh my gosh! My room! My room's on fire! My room! Someone help! Someone help! Don't panic! Don't panic! We're gonna figure this out. Someone call an emergency quick so I can go in there and fix it. Anybody? Anyone gonna call an emergency? Everyone's leaving the apartment. Where's the baby out of get the baby out of there oh my gosh okay okay all right. let's let's um get the fire department no one's calling an emergency for this the place is burning down the place is on fire call the emergency i'm here to help basil get in there quick basil doesn't want to go in there anymore basil go inside the building that's saying like, nope get inside the building quick can you not go in there you can't wait what oh no they locked the door who locked the door why would you lock the door why is the door locked oh boy can i call the fire department for my phone maybe all oh, my stuff was in there <laughs> my beautiful stuff hey stop complaining it's my hotel okay if we let that fire is gonna be in big trouble Thing. Oh my gosh. Uh, as long as it like stays localized of this room, we should be fine. As long as this wall contains it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be fine. Look, let me get on the phone here. Is there like a call to fire department button? Yeah, here we go. Call fire department. I like to report a fire. All right, they're here. See, I called an emergency. No one else did. Oh my God, this place stinks. Get in there. Save the fire. The door's locked though. I couldn't get in. My key card wasn't working. It melted it when I tried to use it. Can you get in there? Okay, good. They can go in there. My gosh, the fire. Yeah, I know it's messy. I know it's messy. Don't judge me. Okay, great job. Great job. There's just a bit over here and then, and then some in the bathroom. There we go. That is one hot bed. Uh, um, uh, uh, okay, good. It's, it's out. It's out. It's okay. We're good. Sorry about your room, buddy. Hopefully, um, it's still somewhat usable. Was that his room? It was his room. Uh... Yeah, yeah, take a shower. After all that, uh, should I walk in on him? Let's walk in on him. Oh, dang it. He walked out of there. What, what happened? What's that sound? Water leak? No! Is that an emergency? We gotta go to room two. Which one's room two? So the fire emergency, that's not an emergency, but that water leakage, that's 100% an emergency? I don't know. All right, let's figure out where room two is. Two, okay. Uh, oh, hang on a second. Oh, the people with the baby have broken the rules? Interesting. And also, they have two babies. We've only ever seen one baby, so I don't know where the other baby's at. We'll worry about that later. We'll worry about that later. I gotta fix their apartment, so let's go over there, fix the water leakage. Let's fix the water problem first, then obviously give them a fine. A heavy fine. That's how we make money. We invite people in who we know will break the rules. Let me find them. Uh, Basil, where are you going? Where are you going? The water leaks the other direction. Where are you going? Basil? Are you meeting with the brats, Basil? I can't believe you're suing me. This is ridiculous. I'm sorry, Basil, but that totally did not slay, okay? That's not the brats' way. Well, you'll be here for my lawyer, okay? Coming after you, brats. Oh my gosh. Basil, go fix the water leakage. Go back over here. All right, go inside. My gosh, there's a lot of water damage here. Holy moly. So what I gotta do? Mop up the puddles can i also use their bathroom because i gotta go if i don't i'm gonna add a new puddle to the floor ah that's good all right fix the sink i only have to repair one thing even though both the sink and the shower are broken yeah but if you could like mop up this it'd be great yeah yeah here they come they have two kids so where's the second one? Oh, hang on uh, do i dislike handiness P probably no because i feel like we're going to be doing a lot of handiness stuff so let's just say no to that oh did i do it oh hang on we did a great job yay we did it sweet right now take a shower there we are 
Ah, feels good. I need this after a long day of whatever we did today. Uh, Basil, um, could you not shower my shower, please? Um, that's weird. Oh, sorry. Well, you know what? Just for that, we're gonna find you. You know, I might have said no to fine. I may have said, you know what? I'll let it slide. But now, double fine. You're getting a five having too many kids here. Slip that under the door. Deal with that. Can't believe that. So where's the second kid? There's only one kid here. They technically have two. So... I'm sure it's fine. Let's go back to my apartment and go to sleep. Uh-oh. Toxic mold pile. We're keeping an eye on it. Don't worry about it. We're, we're keeping a, an eye on it. Is, it. is it this one? Is that the one? I mean, I see mold there. You okay there, Basil? Yeah, maybe we should sleep in the same room that's toxic mold. Look, make yourself a steak. Don't worry about that tomorrow. It's a nice steak dinner. What's going on with my midnight crisis here? Perform five camping activities. Explore the outdoors. Woohoo in risky places. Live the dumpster life. Ah, I just want to live the dumpster life. I don't know. Ah. Hear me out. Dumpster hotel. A hotel. All the rooms are dumpsters. Oh, wait. I already did that. That was the horse hotel. I mean, basically the same thing, right? Basically. All right, let's get rid of this mold because I feel like this mold might kill me. Kill it with fire or just clean it? Let's just clean it. I think we're done with fire. There we go. You know, there's one in my bedroom. Probably not a good idea. Now, the one in the kitchen, that could probably stay. You know, that's not hurting anybody. But the one in my bedroom should probably definitely go. The next thing we got to do is become good friends with a tenant. Ooh. Also achieve a five-star rating in a unit. Okay. Are we close to that? Uh, I got four stars on some of these, so that's not too bad. Hang on a second. I see here six has their walls broken. Who's that? Oh, that's the dogs. That's the dog one. Can I find them again? Let me go visit it. Maybe I gotta visit it to find them. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Five and no pets. Hate to do this, but you have a dog in there, so. And I need money. Hang on. They failed to pay the fine? The heck? Dog! Hey! You! Stop fighting us! Get out of here! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Listen, puppy. Look, it's not about you, okay? But you can't stay here. All right? It's not allowed. No dogs allowed. A rule I made up once I knew that you were going to stay here. So it's nothing about you. It's just I had to do this to make money. Look, let's uh, leash the dog and take the dog on a walk. I don't even see the tenant who's staying here. All right, puppy, let's go for a walk. Yeah, it's like around the lobby. And here is uh, where I keep things like utility stuff. Um, is this it? Is this the walk? Is he done with the walk? Uh, I, guess, I guess that was it. That was the walk from here to there deliver fine for hang on hang on are you the owner of this dog oh my gosh uh, don't worry about that don't worry about that one should i lock her in there no no let's not kill this poor person let's meet them i think i can find her directly right can i can i send her a fine hey is that my dog um why do you have my dog on a leash oh uh yeah um your dog is breaking the rules so i figured i would like look after it Maybe um, take taking for a walk or something. So I walked around the lobby and then that was about it. Oh no. Is the dog infected? Let's get the dog out of here. Get the dog out of here. Remove the dog from the place with the mold. Get the dog out of there. All right, perfect. The dog seems to be glowing. Is that a good thing? Maybe the dog's gonna be like a superhero or something. Um, You know what? Let's, uh, let's unleash the dog. Wait a minute. Don't panic, everybody. Don't panic. Don't panic. Scrub the spores off. Clean that dog. Save the dog, Basil. Save the dog. It's the only thing making us money here anything should have the dog i can't find her anymore you know it'd be a disaster oh the dog's throwing up oh gosh basil cure the dog all right there we go is, is this scrubbing the spores off is this hugging the dog is that doing anything scrub the spores off basil scrub them off maybe i can give the dog a bath look let's bathe the dog it's fine don't panic everybody where's the dog going now puppy i can scrub the spores off but that doesn't seem to do anything i don't know what that does why is that a thing i can pick but that doesn't do anything all right give the dog a bath dr glow on i can't talk to you right now uh i think that's great go for it i can't i can't talk right now we're in an emergency this is a big emergency i got a sick dog who may be radioactive. I don't know. We're going to wash this dog. There we go. All right, yeah, yeah. Kind of scrub, scrub away. Who's, who's calling me now? The mom of the baby wants to take Basil to the Spice Festival. Should we go even though we have a dog emergency? No, I, I, should, I should stay and look out for the dog. I'm sorry, mom of the baby, but I got to go stay with the dog right now. I got I got an emergency. Yeah, Wait. Yay, that helped! The dog is saved! We gave the dog a bath. That's all it took. You know what? We should probably lock this room. No one should be going in here. Uh, Dr. Gluon, seriously, what's going on? 
Yeah, I'm glad you had a good time. Stop calling me. I got emergencies, okay? How'd you get my number anyway? All right, how do I lock this door? How do I stop people from going in here? I don't know. This is like a public space, so I guess anyone can just go in there. Can I not lock that door? So I guess me and you are buds now, huh? Well, I guess we are. Woo -hoo -hoo. I'm still gonna need to find you, though, because no dogs allowed. You understand. I mean, we may be besties and all, but no dogs allowed. I mean, what do you want me to do? No dogs allowed. What? Why do you keep going in there? Get out of there. There's mold in that room. Stay away from that room. As long as the dog doesn't go in there, we're fine. Keep the dog out of there. She can go in there all she wants. That's her thing. She wants to go in the room with the mold? That's her thing. I will keep the dog alive. You know, because if the dog leaves, then I can't find her anymore. All right, there we go. I'll never find. All right, I got to use the bathroom. Let's go back to my own room. Should I take the dog with me? No. No. How about yes? We're taking the dog. Go home. Take the dog. I don't think she's responsible to have that dog. Maybe I'm the one who should get the dog. And even though I can't have dogs in this hotel, I'm willing to find myself just to keep the dog. Yeah. Noble, I know. I know. All right, doggy, here's your new home. Come inside. It's a pretty sweet home. No mold. Recently had it scrubbed. So, you know what I should do? Let's get a dog bowl. Fill it up with food. We'll use some of that under what condition money. Right there. Put some food in there. Perfect. Come on, puppy. I got food in my bedroom now. Come get some. Yeah. Come get some food. Sweet. You know what? What a great day it's been. We've got a dog now, kind of. It's not really our dog, but... We can't just say it is, you know? All right, let's go to sleep. Well, that's going to do it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button. It really helps out. And if you're new here, hit the subscribe button. Till next time, bye-bye.